Hey y'all, Kevin here, and this is Pure Reviews, where I review all kinds of products. So if you are new to the channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button. And in particular, if you find this video useful or helpful, be sure to hit that like button before you go. Maybe leave a comment that simply says thanks. Really helps out the channel a ton, and I greatly appreciate it. So today's product is available on Amazon, and I've included a link in the description that will take you directly to the product page, where you can see the current price point, see if it's on sale, all that lovely information. But what is it? So today's product I want to share with you is a portable fan by a company called HandFan. This is the box that it comes in. Once you open it up, you are of course going to get a user manual. We're going to cover all the features right here in this video. You're also going to get a USB to USB type C charging cable so that way you can keep it all nice and powered up. And then you are going to get the fan itself. So why I like this thing is, as you can see, it is a nice size fan. To give you an idea of the size, it's approximately 10 uh, inches in width. It's about 10 and 3 quarters inches in height, and it is about 3 and a quarter inches in depth, if you will. Um, you can easily just set it on a table, so if you have a workbench or anything like that, you're needing a, a little fan on you, you can do that. It is fully rotatable, 160 degrees, uh, and then it can tilt all the way around, also 360 degrees. So that way you can get it in the perfect position to make sure you are nice and comfortable. Now, another cool thing about this fan is it has this super industrial clip here. So this clip is great. So if you want to utilize this, let's say on a golf cart, or if you have basically any pole mounted, whether it's on a boat, um, in your garage or anything like that, you can clip it on here. Uh, so that way it's nice and supported and hung. They even include on the back side here this extra support which you will screw in to basically kind of preemptively set up the clip itself. Uh, you can also choose to hang this if you wish. There is a little hanging loop right there uh, that you can utilize and hang it from the ceiling. If you're in a tent or you're camping or something like that, then you can angle the fan down. So it's really versatile. A lot of times I end up having it just sitting like so, uh, so that way it is positioned comfortably on me. Now, another cool feature of it is on the back, you will see right here in this pad, this is the battery and this is actually removable. So you can use uh, the clip stand itself again. Just kind of stick that in there, pop this off, and behind it you'll notice you're gonna have the USB plug. That is what's plugging into the battery, but there's also the type C. So if you want to hardwire this fan, you can do that. Just remove the battery and then it will run consistently. Uh, but if you want to utilize the battery, it has the type C charging cable right there. That's how you uh, power it up. Uh, and then it also has a USB, which is how it's powering the fan, but you can utilize this to charge your phone or a tablet. So if you are camping um, or you're on the boat and your phone's dying, you can utilize this to charge up and get some extra battery life on it, which is a nice little feature. There is a little power button that's gonna, if you click that, uh, it'll light up four little lights. And that's just gonna give you a snapshot of how much battery life is left. Uh, to put it back in, just simply uh, line it all up and uh, it snaps right back in place, nice and easy, uh, which is a great little feature of it. So on the back, you're gonna have your multiple controls. So you're gonna have the, the fan button, that's gonna how you're gonna turn it on. Now this particular fan has four different modes. So uh, right now what I just turned on is what I will call kind of your breeze mode, if you will. Uh, the fan is on a very low setting, it's not loud at all, and it will turn on, it'll blow, and then it'll turn off. So you just get like little bursts of wind. Then the next setting is going to be the low setting. Then you're going to have a medium setting and a high setting. So you can find the perfect amount of breeze and wind uh, to cool you off, essentially. Now, that's going to affect the battery life. So this fan has a 10,000 mAh battery. Uh, so that's a lot of battery power. That's why it makes it great. You can use this to charge your tablets and your phones if you need in a pinch. Uh, but what does that mean? That means on the highest setting, you're going to get about six hours runtime of this fan. On the lowest setting, this little energy breeze mode, you're gonna get about 48 hours out of it. So if you are camping or you're out for multiple days, this fan will last that amount of time, which is a nice little feature of it. Um, as I mentioned, uh, it does have also a timer on the back. So next to the fan button, you have a little clock and that's gonna light up. You can have a one hour timer, a two hour timer, or a five hour timer. So Let's say you are sleeping in a tent and you only want it to uh, be on when you're falling asleep. You can put it on the two hour timer if you wish. Uh, and basically it will automatically turn off, which is a nice, another little feature. Also helps save the battery. Um, and then if you just don't want it, the third button, 
Uh, you can just sit that and you'll automatically turn off the device um, when you are not wanting to utilize it. But overall, those are all the little features of this guy. Very versatile fan. Like I said, it works great in a lot of applications, whether you're um, on the golf course, whether you're out in the boat, whether you're in the backyard by the pool, whether you're working in the workbench. Um, you can utilize this fan. Uh, it is very, very versatile. So if you're in the market for a nice little battery powered fan, um, I think this one is totally worth checking out. If there's something that I didn't quite cover that you're a little curious about, feel free to hit me up in the comment section. I do typically respond to those. That is it till the next video. You guys take it easy. Later. Congrats, you made it to the end of the video. Thank you very much. Um, greatly appreciated for the support. Be sure to uh, hit that like button on the video. It really, really does help out. And if you have not subscribed yet, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and hit the notification bell if you want to uh, get notified when new videos come out on this channel.